passion, signs, and a voice. That's all these local activists needed to show their support for climate action in Texas. Fridays for Future is kind of a student-based um, advocacy movement. It was started by Greta Thunberg, who's kind of become really huge on an international stage, but this one in particular is the Global Day of Climate Action. Hey, hey, no about 50 people took part in Friday's march and were there in hopes of educating others about Texas climate issues. Austin was just one of 600 cities around the world participating in marches. But it almost didn't happen in Austin. Whenever we were looking back in February, we realized there was no event happening in Austin and so we wanted to take the initiative as the student org to be able to actually establish it on campus. Those that participated in the Fridays for Change climate march made their way from the UT Tower to the Texas State Capitol. Many say they're concerned about rising carbon dioxide emissions and the global temperature increase. Speakers at the state capitol hoped lawmakers heard their desire to have ERCOT held accountable for the power grid shortage in 2021 and shutting down the Fayette Coal Power Plant, which contributes to the 1 billion tons of coal the U.S. burns every year. All of us are experiencing climate change now, and it will get worse as we get older. You just have to put your own lifetime on these climate projections to see that it's not really a pretty picture. I guess my survival depends on it later on in the future. The lives of tens of millions, if not billions, is at stake. This is what democracy looks like! In Austin, Madeline Salinas, Reporting Texas TV.